Welcome back, Wolves. I'm Esme Miranda with Wolves Student News. If you haven't paid your school fees for the 2018-2019 school year, please do so at the earliest convenience. If you have any questions, please see Ms. Brettlinger in the main office. Students who applied for NHS will be notified in February if they have been accepted. As a reminder that testing fees for AP testing are due in the next few weeks. Financial aid is offered to, for those who qualify. During the week of February 4th, teachers will begin consulting with students about course selection for the 2019-2020 school year. Parent-teacher conferences are Wednesday, February 6th from 4 to 8 p.m. and will provide a chance for parents to consult with teachers over grades and the future of their child's academic prowess. Our annual informational meeting regarding our College Credit Plus CCP program will be held on February 6th from 7 to 8 p.m. in the WCHS Auditorium. Important deadlines, courses offered at WCHS, and the process to apply and be approved for CCP will be shared. The next one-hour delay is Wednesday, February 13th. No school on Friday, February 15th due to a professional development day for teachers, and no school on Monday, February 18th due to President's Day. ACT testing for all juniors will take place on Wednesday, February 20th. Juniors will report to the third floor at 735. Grades 9, 10, and 12 will be on a regular schedule and may have classroom changes. Seniors will have the option for a senior learning day. After lunch, juniors will report back to the third floor to participate in a career exploration event. If you have any questions about ACT testing day, please stop by Student Services. Seniors, if you are ready to submit your learning day plan for February 20th, go to School G for the form. You will need to complete the form and meet with your PAC teacher to discuss how you will present your learning. If you do not participate in the learning day, you will, will report to school as usual. If you have any questions, please Ms. Auten or Mr. Gephardt. WCHS Student Council will be hosting the Wolves After Dark Winter Festival on February 23rd. The festival will take place in the cafe and on Main Street from 7 to 11 p.m. There will be games, music, food trucks, and lots of fun. Tickets will go on sale on February 19th for about $10. The world famous Harlem Wizards will visit WCHS on Thursday, March 7th at 7 o'clock p.m. Doors open at 6. For an evening of great fun and fundraising, the Wizards will play a game against a team of West Claremont administrators and teachers. All proceeds will benefit our students and after prom. The event will feature a variety of fun interactive extras to complement the Wizards' dazzling demonstration of hoops artistry. The game will conclude with the Wizards' signature dance extravaganza that will have the crowd on their feet. Funded in 1962, the Wizards have played over 15,000 games through, throughout the U.S. that raised over $25 million for schools and charitable causes. The Wizards have also played in over 25 foreign countries on five continents. General admission tickets are $10 in advance and $12 at the door. Courtside Plus tickets are $25. These tickets get you first or second row seating and a meet and greet before the game. Tickets will go on sale soon. For more information, please contact West Claremont PTSO at gmail.com. On Saturday, May 4th, the Run for the Future Scholarship Fund will be participating in the Flying Pig 5K. We hope to get at least 50 students, teachers, and staff members from the West Claremont School District to run or walk with us to raise awareness and money for the scholarship fund. Please email or see Ms. Hornberger in room 3 or 4 for more details. We want to uh, give a big shout out to La Rosa's and Arby's. They sent us uh, coupons for free pizzas and sliders at Arby's. What are we going to do with these coupons, Mr. Hudson? Well, for the La Rosa's coupon for a medium two, pe or two topping pizza, the 125th Instagram of WCH Rep the Pack um, Instagram follower gets the free two, or I'm sorry, one medium two topping pizza. And for the 250th Twitter follower, they get two sliders from Arby's. So please get on and follow us on WCHS Rep the Pack on Instagram and Twitter. That's fantastic. Now we're going to go over and do the Respect the Pack hallway expectations. We're going to go over the Respect the Pack hallway expectations. Don't forget to travel the direct route to every place that you're going to in the hallways. Also, keep our hallways clean. Help our custodial staff out, doing a great job. Please help them out. Also, respect full language all the way through the hallways from class to class and to the restroom. Also, be mindful of others and keep your volume to, to level two. The most important thing is, remember to respect and be mindful of your others. 
using better language than what we do in the hallway. Thank you, and don't forget to respect the pack. Wolves, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. You can follow us on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook at WCHS Productions. Are you repping the pack? Pride, academics, community, and kindness. Follow at WCHS Rep the Pack on Twitter and Instagram to see all the amazing things students and teachers are doing to rep the pack. Thanks for tuning in this week. I'm Esme Miranda with Wolves Student News. We will see you back here next Monday.